Hey guys, RHS School Kid here, and I'm finally back with a new video. Uh, this video will be on how to get a screen recorder that records both audio and video for iOS 7. Uh, I'm uploading this video because I was looking so long on where to find one, and I just couldn't find one that worked. And I finally, just with enough research looking up, I finally found one that works. And so I thought I'd share it with you guys. So you're going to need a couple of things. One of the things is iFile which you'll see right here. Okay. You may you're going to also need activator. Okay? And it is with a jailbreak. So, Cydia. So you're going to open up your Cydia. And when it loads up, you're going to want to go to manage right here. Manage tab right down here. You guys probably if you know what a jailbreak is, you probably know where that is. Your sources and then edit add and you're going to add the Insanely Eye source right here. Uh, the link will be down in the description. Um, so you're going to need this. And this is one of my favorite repositories or repos because it has a lot of stuff in it, a bunch of tweaks and apps and cool things. And there's just so much in here. And they're very high and they're very, uh, they always update their things. And it's, it's just really nice. So if you go over to your search and you search up, um, iFile, let's see, we want iFile first. So you just search your iFile. It's right here. I got it with um, the big boss. It's, um, this is how it is. But I actually got it before it, um, before you needed to purchase it. So I got it for free. But now that you have um, Insanely Eye, you can get this one. And this one, Insanely Eye, is free. And it'll work just the same. Um, so it'll be fine. So it's a file manager. So you're going to go ahead and install that. And once that's done, you can look up, uh, just look up record my, and it should come up with these. Now see, this app one, I am running iOS 7.0.4. So whenever I try to install this one, it'll give me this thing right here. Depends. iOS firmware is, it's actually greater I, my iOS 7 is greater, so I'm not able to get it because it's greater than, I mean, it's less. Well, no, yep, no, it's greater. Sorry, my bad. But it's 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 greater than just iOS 7, so I can't get that. So you can just get the tweak one. And this one is from, I think, insanely high. Should be. Nope, it's from Big Boss. Okay. Um, well, insanely is for iFile, and then here's a different one, I know it's from Big Boss, so you get this, uh, record my swing, tweak, you do this, it'll tell you some details about down here, um, you click right here where it says modify for you, it'll say install, and you confirm, in the top right, and then so you're going to install that, so then, at this point, you're done with Cydia, so you can exit out of that, and the first thing you want to do is just open up your settings, because you need to configure it. Now, um, you're also going to need Activator from Cydia, so if you want to go ahead and get that too, should just be under Big Boss. It's still in its beta stage, but it does work. Um, also, you can just, you can customize it from there, or you can just do it right in here. Um, so you're going to go to your settings, you're going to go down here where it says Record My Screen, you touch that, and here it'll say Activation Methods. So you can either do this in Activator or here. I think it's pretty easy here because it'll basically let you know some easy ways to do it, and you don't have to go trying to figure out activator. So you just click touch that and device. So it'll say locked, unlocked. So device unlocked via slide. And so here you go. So your home button. So you can you can start it up with home button. So you can double press home button, but that's what I use to cancel the app. So I don't use that. Uh, long hold, you can press and hold the home button. Uh, short hold, single press, um, triple press. I use triple press because it's not really used much else unless you want to um, turn it to negative. Uh, if you set that yourself in settings. So I just put it to triple press. So basically what that means is when I press the home button three times, it's going to ask me if I want to record. I can press it, and when I'm done recording, I can press it three times again, and it'll stop. Now, um, why we need iFile. Um, and I'll tell you that right now before, we, uh, before we're done. So under here, you'll see manage recordings. So we'll see recordings that are being done or have been already done. And the way to get to those is with iFile. So if you open up your iFile to get to the videos that you've recorded, after you're done recording them, 
you're gonna go it should just if you press this home button right here it'll just take you right here and it's var mobile and oh, it's gonna say registration failed because they haven't fixed out all the tweaks and bugs yet in it for iOS 7 so basically if you start right here you're gonna go into var scroll down you're gonna find mobile or if you press the home button it'll take you right there you're gonna go to documents in your documents right here this movie file that's where it's gonna be um, so that's where your movie file is if it's not working you can just refresh it just pull it down refresh and it should show up so that's where your videos are going to be stored so then back in settings uh, you can also edit them so your video size how big you want it your orientation what orientation you want it also whether you want it to record audio your sample rate and your channels and then you have some credits so I really like this app it's a very good tweak to have with Cydia it also it allows you to record your iOS 7 so I hope you guys like this video make sure you like comment and uh, subscribe and I'll see you again next time with a new video.